Hello, everyone. I will briefly introduce the paper titled Lightweight GCN Encoder and Sequential Decoder for Multi-Candidate Capone Route Planning in Road Network. Our motivation for this study originated in the scenery shown in this slide. When a passage wants to get on at the point P021, the driver has to travel along the brown route. However, if the passage can move 40 meters from P021 to P022, the driver can travel along the shorter green route, thus saving the driving distance. In fact, the small passage movement, 40 meters, can save a huge driver distance. 1,500 meters. In today's world of massive daily redship demand, this means that we can not only save a significant amount of carbon emissions, but also save passengers' travel costs through thinner passage movements. Therefore, we propose the multi-candidate uh, multi Caponi route planning problem. The goal is to find the most appropriate points and predict a sequence with the smallest root length under the precedence constraint and the capacity constraint. We constructed a lightweight GCN encoder and sequential decoder called LightGD. It mainly consists of three components. The encoder lends the node and edge representations based on binary filters and variance filters. The pre-training classification task determines classification labels based on whether nodes and edges appear in the optimal routes and pre-train the weights of encoder. The decoder predicts the nodes and the sequence based on the point network and the facial crossover module. We conduct experiments on uh, synthetic and real-world data sites, including three cities. The statistics of data sites are shown in the table. The baseline methods include a greedy method, three machine learning methods, and the optimal solution through exact algorithms. It can be seen that LightGD can achieve the best performance except for the OPT. We also conduct the ablation studies. The results show that each module designed is useful. In fact, the facial crossover module plays an important role. That's all. Thank you for listening.